<laughs> well, we're joined by Phoebe from Foxy Styling and we're sitting in this gorgeous home, 55 Orderly Avenue, Orderly, and everyone has seen this because uh, it has been well promoted on pretty much every forum. Now, um, obviously, Phoebe, you came involved and we'll just got a brief uh, styling, but not only that, um, how did this home fare in the market? Um, because obviously styling is a very important component and especially when you've got a home which is beautifully finished, but if we went onto the market without furniture, it might have been a different result. Definitely would have been. Yeah. Yep, very, it's the upstairs space. Yeah. Yeah. It's very, very big. It's a very big home on a very, it's a narrow block, um, but not only that, the, to give everyone a brief, we ended up having 74 buyers through the property. We had four offers. Uh, we sold just after auction. There was two registered bidders at auction and four parties waiting in the wings. So we thought that was actually a success. May not have sold at auction, but it doesn't mean that it actually isn't a success because the, the price that we actually achieved, everyone is astounded at and definitely the owners are very happy with. And I think for here, we had a briefing and it was a bit unusual for you because, what was it? A little bit um, more... Bit adventurous. Adventurous, yes. yes. With a bit of attitude. <laughs> yeah. So we've got velvet <laughs> we and do. leather and uh, yeah, I think it worked really well. Yeah, so we um, delved into a little bit more colour. Yes. Um, something that you'd given us feedback on, scrolling yeah. through realestate.com. It's becoming yeah. very cream. Yeah. So we bought in pinks and blues and leather. Yeah. yeah. Coco Republic was our definite, um, our inspiration for this one. Yeah. And yeah, love how it's all come together. Yeah, and buyers really did react well to it because they could see it was a younger demographic or very professional. Um, so there's a lot of interest here in regards to the furniture and these two tub chairs were everyone's favourites. So um, they're a navy velvet with a beautiful brass heavy base. Um, women generally like those chairs and men didn't. So <laughs> it was a very talking piece. I loved it. I was just like, okay, well, I can have them in my house, but that's okay. So realistically, in regards to, let's say, moving forward, Phoebe and I have had a long working relationship and we style most properties with Phoebe. And if Phoebe doesn't, it will be generally a stylist of some sort. Um, but the reality is the investment uh, wasn't a high cost investment in regards to the experience for a buyer, they could see how it worked. Um, and the reality is, is there, was there any sort of issues that you had to encounter with this install? Uh, no, 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 aside from zoning living space. So we wanted to go casual, family at the top. Um, and then you, at your request, we made this bedroom downstairs as, yeah. a, as a study. Yeah. So initially we had talked about making that one into a media space, but mm -hmm. no bedroom other yeah. than that. There was no other issues. Um, one thing I guess that you had a conversation with when we walked in was offsetting dining tables, things like that. But it's such a grand, when you walk through here to see the pool, it's mm -hmm. such a grand journey of this space. Is, it's beautiful. Yeah. So, well, I think we had success. Yeah, I, I think so, definitely. Yeah. So realistically, um, it was great to chat. We haven't chatted for a couple of years, no. but uh, the trends currently, so we're still in that winter market, which is velvets and the creams, but we're now going to spring. In a couple of weeks' time, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, the market, we're just waiting for that one. Um, so spring this year, it looks like it's pastels back to linens, yes. a bit of grey that I'm seeing, they're very trend-based. I don't think it's going to branch out too far. We haven't had yeah. trade fairs, everything like that this year hasn't, yeah. hasn't really gone ahead. So you'll notice that a lot of the same trends, I think they're just going to hang around for a bit longer yeah. rather than switching out. Watch out because it's four weeks away and we'll be into oh, spring. So Yep. So look forward to it. <laughs> and if you need any um, questions answered, Phoebe's always readily available. You can contact her via the website or give me a call on 0417 877 828.